Hey y'all and welcome back to my channel. So I have for y'all today a Get Unrated With Me video. And so some of the products that I'm going to be using are the Equate Makeup Wipes by Walmart, which you can compare to the Neutrogena Wipes, the Dove Sensitive Skin Bar to thoroughly cleanse my skin. And then I'm going to follow up with the Hydra Mask by Salt XO to tone and even my skin. And then their Anti-Acne Serum as well that helps reduce acne. And then the Black Girl Sunscreen to top it all off. And then I wear contacts. So I purchased this cute contacts lens case from Amazon, which I linked in the description box. So let's get into it. So on this day, this was a photo shoot day. And so I had a full out day of just being out in makeup. And I also had a date night. And so I'm just going to start off by prepping. And I'm going to use my makeup white removers that I got from Walmart and these makeup wipes work really well I've used the Neutrogena ones as well and I feel like the Equate ones are just as efficient and just as good I think they have the same product as well so I like to use those but I'm going to pin my hair back because you know when you get your makeup professionally done it's on your neck it's on your forehead it's on your ears it's everywhere so yeah I'm just going to start by removing my eyelashes this is my favorite part of getting unready is getting those eyelashes off And so I'm just starting now to just remove all the makeup. It may look like I'm rubbing rough. But if you've ever used these makeup wipes before, then you know they're very gentle. And you already know that the, the formula is very soft as well. So you definitely want to get off as much makeup as you can with one wipe. And that's what I'm going to do here. I'm going to try to get off as much as I possibly can using this one wipe. I'm gonna go in with a second wipe because I'm pretty sure there's more <laughs> so yeah I'm just gonna go in with a second wipe and try to get off any more makeup that might still be there the most stubborn part of makeup I would have to say is the eyeliner so um, I try to focus on my eyes a lot just to get that liquid eyeliner that's been dried throughout the day try to get all of that off see there was definitely more makeup so now I'm going to go in with the Dove sensitive skin bar this is a universal product everybody uses it um, I use it on my body sometimes but for the most part I just use my feminine wash for my body but I love the Dove sensitive skin bar for my face and I remember watching it on YouTube some years back that they said it's best to wash your face for at least 60 seconds and so I try to hold true to that I try to thoroughly cleanse my face with a very gentle cleanser which I use the Dove sensitive skin bar and I just try to take my time massage it in and do that thorough 60 second wash and then I just pat dry with a white towel just in case there is makeup left over I can see but of course I've thoroughly cleansed my face already 
And now I'm going to go in with the Hydra Mask and Brightening Mask by Salt XO. I love this product. And this is not a skin bleaching product or anything like that. This is to help reduce the hyperpigmentation and help reduce the look of any like dark marks that you may have. And also for me, it works really well for my texture skin. So if I've had some breakouts or I have just, you know, small little texture skin like around my nose and those types of areas in my cheek. This does a really great job of reducing the look of those. And sometimes I've noticed if I've used it more than once in a week, that the all of that texture skin is pretty much gone. So yeah, I love this Hydra Mask. They have a wide variety of skincare products. And so I primarily just use their this mask and their feminine products. But yeah, I'm going to just apply this all over my face um, just so that it can really settle into my skin after you know i've been in makeup for quite a bit maybe about 12 hours or so and now that i fully applied it, i'm going to leave it on for 10 minutes rinse it off and it's feeling already good looking good my skin feels fresh and now i'm gonna go in with i try to i don't know which one i like to do first and so you see me debating but i'm gonna go in with the anti-acne serum by sodix o as well i absolutely love this serum it really does it's it's for anti-acne it reduces acne on your face if you use it consistently and cleans your skin consistently but i also use it just daily just to help with um, any breakouts that I may have already on my face. And it does help reduce all of that acne. So I really swear by this product. I'll link their uh, website below and also their Instagram handle. I'll put it there so you can check them out. But yeah, I love the anti-acne serum. Yes, glow and then we're gonna go in one of my other favorite products the black girl sunscreen listen it's been a myth that that the that the girls the melanin girls do not need sunscreen we definitely do i use this daily and this is primarily what i use throughout the day i don't wear makeup throughout the week and so my daily skin routine just consists of the anti-acne serum and the black girl sunscreen I like to take my time and just massage it into my skin. And I know this because I am an oily girl that when I overnight when I wake up, I have this amazing glow. It, it just so fresh looking when I wake up. I love it. And I wear contacts. So I found this contacts lens case on Amazon and I give it a four star because of the tweezers that they have that are meant to help you take your contacts out. If you have long nails, then you know what I mean. You, you may need that little help, but I been wearing contacts my whole life so I can do it with nails without nails. But yeah, I'm just going to take my hair down, put my glasses on and go and watch TV and relax. So thank you so much for joining with me. I hope I see you next time.